So this is Spectre. Obviously, if you've used Genesis in the past, you're going to notice the similarities between the two. What this means is, for the time being, and it's just guesswork for now, that this is an updated and active and running version of Genesis. There are a little bit, you know, politics and drama potentially behind this, but it's working. Uh, it's, you know, it was a fan favorite for many due to its simplicity, amount of content and such. And today I'm going to show you how to get this running for QWERTY. Okay, let's set up Spectre. First thing we do is boot up QWERTY, slide along to the System tab and go down to File Manager. We need to add a new source here, so we click on that. And what you want to do is copy and put that address exactly as you see it. If you're on a desktop, you can just copy and paste that. If you're on another device, make sure you've got it exactly like that. And hit done. Now, Cody does have this habit of auto renaming your media sources and repository isn't a very memorable name. So we'll go ahead and just change that. We'll obviously rename that to film Cody just for this demonstration. You can call it whatever you want. Press OK on that. It's now been added into the sources. We go back and this time we click the system button. And then into add-ons and what we're going to do is install from a zip file point over to what we just set up which is film Cody for me if you renamed it of course it'll be that and what we need is to get this one right here which is the repository once you click that it will be enabled pretty quick but what i suggest you do is let this update section finish right here if you notice this just to stop any conflicts we'll go ahead and wait for that go into install from repository now i've got quite a few in here for each user it's going to be a little bit different but there it is this is the cody film cody.com repo and in here obviously we want to head into the video add-ons and there it is the spectre genesis fork and when we click it and install it we'll wait for that notification down here <laughs>